Hi, my name is Dr. Erin Daniel with Rejuvenate Life Chiropractic, rejuvenate-life.com. It's important what you do with your dash. Today, I want to talk about the power of habits. Okay, it's October, Chiropractic Awareness Month, habits. We all have habits. Do we have good habits? Do we have neutral habits or do we have bad habits? Are our habits propelling us forward or are they hindering us? So the habits that we're trying to get into in a wellness chiropractic model those habits, I like to call one of the things I recommend for patients the power hour. These are healthy habits. 20 minutes of prayer or meditation a day, 20 minutes of walking, and 20 minutes of healthy food prep. Okay, something simple we can do. Those are healthy habits. What's an unhealthy habit? I'll give you an example of something that could be either. Facebook. Facebook could be healthy in which you're learning, you're striving, you're, you're connecting with a group of people, like-minded people who are all trying to raise up a goal. Or Facebook can be a time sucker in which you're spending too many time, you know, too much hours scrolling just on things that are not going to help you propel forward towards your goal at all. Facebook could be beneficial in connecting with family or friends. Facebook could be detrimental in the sense of not verbally connecting with people and just social media connecting, we're losing the one-on-one -on -one actual meeting people face-to-face. -face. Um, different studies have shown us that the actual person-to-person -person interaction, not a person-to-video can be really helpful. That's why coming into a chiropractic office and using my videos as support to help continue and help feed outside of the office, it it's becomes then a great tool. Okay, so lots of things that we can do. Um, again, I have an app, I have a community. Again, that community is designed to get people to, to be connected with other like-minded people and use it as a positive tool. So everything that has the potential to do good has the potential to do harm. And so we wanna make sure that the habits that we're creating daily have the potential for us to do good and move us towards what we're looking to do in life instead of detract um, away from them. So again, I'm Dr. Erin Daniel with Rejuvenate Life Chiropractic, rejuvenate-life.com. It's important what you do with your dash.